Yo, 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 what's going on guys? It's your boy Envy. I hope you guys enjoy this commentary. There's no face cam in here, but I promise you this is going to be a great commentary. It is about domestic violence and that's something dead, dead serious and you just don't want to joke around about. Uh, as everybody has heard what happened with Ray Rice and uh, there's a video footage that came out on TMZ uh, that was just god awful. It was the most pitiful thing I've ever seen a human being do. Well, actually, we have seen some worse things, but just how degrading that makes Ray Rice just from just from that one clip. You know, it it disgusts me on how terrible and just it was just disgusting. Um, and the worst part about it is that he took two shots. Okay, like, you know, you know how you make a mistake, like, oh, you do something, not saying, like, hitting someone or doing something like that. You make some kind of mistake because it was just, you, you know, you weren't thinking. But for you to do it a second fucking time and knock her out cold, if you guys didn't see in the video, I don't know if you guys have seen the video, but, you know, yeah, you could probably find it on YouTube somewhere. Uh, the, the second punch that he... Uh, punched his wife now which is pathetic she almost broke her neck right on the rail on the side she was knocked unconscious right at the spot she fell straight down and she went right for this rail it could have hit her right in the neck paralyzed her killed her all that it's just crazy it's crazy to see people in society now that just have the mindset that they could do whatever the fuck they want and live with no consequence well, this is some good news. We actually are doing something about it. And for probably about a good over six months, it's been investigated and everything like that. And what what kills me is why wasn't Ray Rice in jail already? You know, the police was given the uh, video and they saw everything. And they haven't done anything th due to the wife saying that it was her mistake and all that, you know, and not filing charges. Still, you see a fucking grown man laying this little petite woman out and then dragging her out onto the out of the elevator. That is pathetic. That guy needs to go to jail. And in all honesty, if he plays a single game in the NFL, I've lost so much respect for Roger Goodell, the whole NFL staff, everything, all the players. I, in, in all honesty, if I see Ray Rice going back on the field, I feel like that the defense that they're going to be uh, – you know, facing against or just the team in general are not gonna, they're gonna boycott the game because they will not put up with this stuff. It's sad to see individuals do this. It honestly is. But what it comes down to is that you're a grown ass man, Ray Rice. You are a grown ass man. You have the life in your hands, the world in your hands, and you fucking blew it. You are a fucking idiot you're a fucking joke you are a disgrace to your family you're a disgrace to everything that you worked hard for everything that you worked hard for is fucking gone now you're not gonna play in the nfl you're not gonna you're probably gonna go to jail after this but seriously guys this is something very very serious if you guys are in ever a situation like this with ray rice I i'm sorry but you have no help you like if you touch a woman if you touch a kid if god forbid if you ever touch a kid you're gonna suffer you're gonna pay you're gonna pay these tough tough consequences and i really just hope you guys make sure that you guys think things through before you react it's something that us when we are younger at a you know 15 16 17 18 years old we just react off first instinct and that's what defines the mature people and the immature people you just people just need to grow up and they have to act like adults. There's certain situations where you have to act like an adult. If you want to be a kid, go ahead. Have fun. Do all that stuff. But when it comes to a decision where you are going to suffer consequences or you're going to go walk away and enjoy the time with your family, all that, make sure you pick that second decision. Not going out and punching a kid or a child or anything like that. Like, please, guys, 
please listen to what I'm saying here. Make sure you guys spread the word about domestic violence. It's actually something very seriously serious. Sorry about that. And it's just something that we shouldn't be, you know, just letting just brush away from us so that is basically it i hope you guys enjoy this commentary i hope you guys like this new mic i love it honestly but uh yeah make sure you guys leave a like and comment i'm envy i'm out deuces